Welcome to the Grid Computing Tutorials. In this tutorial, we are going to show you how to run long lasting applications through job submission. First of all, we need to initiate a grid proxy with the command grid proxy init. We have two possibilities to run jobs in a synchronous and asynchronous way. The command globus job run is used for synchronously executing your application. The required parameters are first the job manager and second the full path of the application in the remote machine. After a few minutes the program execution will be finished and you will receive the standard output from the remote machine directly on your screen. To execute the same application in an asynchronous way, we will use the Globus Job Submit command with the same parameters as in the previous example. This command returns a job ID which we will use later on to obtain information about the job status and the job output. To retrieve the current status, we can use the command globus job status with the returned job ID as parameter. When the job is finished, we can retrieve the job output with the command globus job get output. The parameters in this case are the job manager, the job ID, and either minus out or minus r, depending on whether you would like to have the standard output or the standard error. To finalize our example, we will now destroy the grid proxy we create at the beginning. 